Hi, Quilt Tube. It's Colleen. And this is Cheryl, and you're stitching with the Sisterlies. Quilting and stitching and whatever else we're doing with us. <laughs> <laughs> um, this is, I don't even know the date, the 18th, the 17th, the 18th, April 18th, yeah. 2024. And we are a channel about quilting and sewing and appliqueing and stuff like that, crafting and yeah. what have you. We also have a floss tube that we do separately, which is also on stitching with a sister lease, but some people like them separate. So we are, <laughs> if anything, we are going to do that, I guess. <laughs> well, I don't know why it needs to be separate, but it does, I guess. Um, so we're close to 6,000 subscribers. And so that's kind of exciting. We are, this Quilt Tube is actually being sponsored and it's being sponsored by Mrs. Quilty. Yes. Now, if you were here, you'd be going. <laughs> but I, I don't do that. So she is, Mrs. Quilty is a subscription box and um, I think it comes monthly and this is the box and we're going to unbox it right now. Yay. And I guess I could show you that. Uh, here? I can't. We couldn't see it. Oh, they could see it in the. Oh, nice. And then um, it comes with a book, which has, I think it's got. Yeah, it has. Uh, let me see. It's good for beginning quilters. In fact, I think I will use this as a giveaway. So this is a value-packed quilting box. It's got a delightful selection of carefully selected items that's worth $108.90. Um, and it comes with everything you need to do these projects, which you probably can't see, so I will tell you what they are. Kind of. <laughs> um, there's a block of the month pattern. There's 16 fat quarters from the Lemon Groove collection. There's nice. a fold-over fold elastic for making this headband that they have in here. There's lavender buds for your sachet. Oh, I guess we could show you lavender blood buds for your sachet, because you can make a sachet. Here are the uh, 16, they're both the same, 16 uh, fat quarters. Nice. Pretty cool. fabric. Yes. And smells good. It smells like lavender. Lavender. There's a lavender sachet pattern that you can make. There's enough fabric to make all these. There's a cosmetic bag you can make with instructions. There's a headband pattern, which is what the elastic is for. The wow. Zipper, That's zipper a is, lot of patterns. The zipper is for um, the cosmetic bag or whatever kind of bag you want. Yeah, and you can make it, and there's a yoga mat quilt pattern with instructions. Wow. And then there's also where is this one? A wrist pin, a wrist pin cushion. Oh, I love that! I have Isn't one of those. Cool? Yeah, especially when we're long arming. Well, I guess oh, anytime. yeah, I yeah. use it all the time. So all of that is in here, and they have given us a discount, and I think it's. Sister Lee's 20. I will link below um, the discount you would use if you wanted to do a subscription. I always want to say prescription. <laughs> subscription. <laughs> when you're older, everything's a prescription. But <laughs> anyway, so there's eight patterns in your box for you nice. to use and the fabric in which to make it. And they give you step by step directions. And that's um, wonderful. Yeah. So it's, it's pretty cool. So thank you, Mrs. Quilty, for sponsoring this. Yes. And I think you get 20% off of your first box. Nice. Thing, I'm sorry. The other thing is um, we have started memberships on our channel. Well, we will when we get to 6,000. And so there's three levels. And basically, uh, I'm going to be doing quarterly table toppers or table runners, small projects. And Cheryl is going to inspire us with all her crafty <laughs> and sewing 
endeavors. Yeah. So. Really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Cheryl been pain, so she's not. Yeah. She hasn't thought everything out, but um, or maybe you haven't. I'm speaking for you. I'm trying nope. to help you. I'm. I know Cheryl's <laughs> going to be doing crafting things, gardening. Not yeah. gardening. Not gardening. Right, but I mean, like little d decor, like yeah, make this and that, and yeah, and so that. And on mine, it'll be. Um, either you can use your scrap scraps, or Cheryl suggested. Um, we provide you the materials at cost. So, yeah, that's the housekeeping. How you been, sister, with your hurdy pink? Can you well, tell everybody? I got, I got one more housekeeping. Okay. This is actually a pattern that we gave away on our cross stitch on stitching with the sisterly, but it's got lost in Ed's truck when he was supposed to mail it. So I'm doing it on quilt tube. And then when we do cross floss tube i'm going to show it again but charlotte i'm so sorry it's i'm going to mail it out this week <laughs> i said i got an ed's truck on one of my trips to the hospital in the last couple weeks and i went oh my gosh you didn't mail this uh -huh. oh, i couldn't believe it he did that with <laughs> so i'm sorry Charlotte. he did that with um well, he gets busy. I mean, he's working, to be fair. He's working, and then he stops along the way to look at jobs and probably forgets about the mailbox or it falls. Give him benefit. Give him grace. <laughs> but he did Whatever. that with, uh, chicken salad. Remember, I was missing two or three pieces. Yes. So you had yep. to. And I kept, nope, they're not here. You think I would learn. You yes. think I would learn. <laughs> so on the community post, I put a little poll in there and how you all thought Cheryl hurt her back. She injured it. She didn't go in for surgery. How did you hurt your back, sister? Who won? <laughs> I don't know. No, you don't know. <laughs> well, I don't know how figure it out. After the last floss tube or quilt tube that we did, I think we did both at the same time. We're not doing that today. <laughs> right. Um, I went to play pickleball. <laughs> and um the one of the first things they teach you not to do is you never run backwards because you have no center of your center of gravity is off. And so I clearly thought that I did not have to worry about that, that I am so good that I could run backwards and not have my center of gravity off. Even I found when you out were that, young, you shouldn't do that. <laughs> yes, not doesn't matter how old you are. Uh, but I clearly gravity had its way with me, and so I tumbled backward. What was the meanness of you? <laughs> Just what? Oh yeah. <laughs> so I fell backwards, um, and I hit my head on the ground. So I gave myself a concussion, and I fracture. I did. I had a compression fracture on my mid back and uh, which then also spurred on an old um, an old issue in my lower back and my neck from a car accident. So it's been, it's been a painful three weeks. Cheryl will be walking <laughs> in a walker. I will have my cane. Cheryl will have her walker. <laughs> but we'll keep quilting and yeah, stitching. So, <clears throat> so I have to apologize for the, Zoom quilting that I wanted to do next week. I there's oh, no way I'm gonna be able to do it, so I'm gonna have to postpone that for one more month. I just can't sit very long. Yeah. So, um, uh, one thing I learned is when you when you are standing, you have um 500 pounds of pressure on your back. When you're laying down, you have 50 pounds of pressure on your back. Is it when you're on our weight or something, or is it just no? Like it is. That's just a general. When you're sitting down, you have 5,000 pounds of pressure on your back. So that's oh. why when you sit for long periods of time, it's not good for your lower back. Yeah, or your she feet. Also, or your right. So she also gave me. I told her, well, when can I get back to pickleball, and when can I get back to stitching? And she said, well. <laughs> she said you'll get back to pickle uh, you'll get back to stitching quicker than you will pickleball so yeah. 
Um, but she gave me exercises to do for, cause when you're sewing so many times you're hunched over or when you're stitching yeah, and so there's exercise you could do cause you have to reverse your, your spine out of the position that gets me with. with. So anyway, it's, it's yeah. actually been really good. And yeah, I told, I was trying exactly. to convince her that I was, I had her very straight back and she goes, Sure. <laughs> oh, I wouldn't even ask a doctor. I can remember from the time I could walk, mom and dad and you guys pounding my back, stand up straight. <laughs> I don't think yeah. you do. So yeah. So anyway, some of it's just age and some of it's just dumbness that I did. I think a lot of it is the second, but you know, <laughs> I don't even think it's dumbness. It's just you get, you know how you get all wrapped up in something and yes i get i get overly competitive and the worst part was i didn't even win the point and i i can't remember at some point because i've been on pain medication somebody asked me if i won the point and i said yes and i'm thinking why did i say yes no well, i just because you just, just to answer <laughs> it doesn't matter what the answer is you're just going to answer I, I, was I, don't like, I don't recall you being very competitive as a, as a kid um, I'm more competitive with myself than I am anybody else. Uh -huh. I, I actually laugh at people a lot, which isn't real good. That's yeah, not you good. Can throw cards or the oh no monopoly board or you know. No, I'm the one. I'm the youngest. I figure out how to get even. Yeah. <laughs> oh really? But anyway, <laughs> uh, we played. I taught you fifty-two card pickup, and you kept you. I told you you had to practice till you got it right, and you did. You picked those. Cards I believe you. Times. I am. I'm. A, I am also gullible. <laughs> <laughs> gullible uh, not so much anymore. <laughs> not so much anymore. <laughs> anyway, do you have any quilt whips that you can show? Can you move enough to show or no? I have nothing. I've worked on. I have something I got in the mail. But I'll show that later, but nothing. Okay. So I have some whips because I cleaned out the guest room so people can use the closet if they so choose. Chose. <laughs> and I found these. You're going to laugh. Where was this place we were at, Cheryl? It was in Oregon. Pendleton. It's oh, yeah. Wool. It's the wool Pendleton Woolen Mills. Yeah. yeah. Pendleton. And we got these panels. Mm. I got one for James. I think you got one for Christopher. I don't know. Or or one of the kids. Because you I think you finished yours. Yeah. I did not. But so I found this. It's not ironed or can you see it? Well, if you hold it still, I pray could. Oh, I, gotta, I gotta get oh there you go. Oh yeah. I don't know Star who it Wars. Is. Who is it? Star Wars. Oh, I know, but is it Darth Vader? Or oh, he's upside down. Well, that's what I was going to say. I only see the, the, um, oh yeah, there he is. That he's, kind of a, he's a fighter with a sword. Do you see? <laughs> oh yeah, I see, but it's not Darth Vader. I can't think of his name. Just a fighter. Yeah. Well, he fighter. has a name. I can't think of his name. Oh, fighter George. Fighter. Fighter. fighter George. Star Wars fighter. <laughs> And then I this oh beautiful sister long again. So this I think I made this so we could practice long arm quilting on it. That was lot so long ago. I, I can't, know. I can't so, believe it. One more. <laughs> oh my gosh. These were all finished and you didn't long I have long armed. This one, I think I was in the beginning of, I think I was making Around the World. Oh, know? yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's beautiful. I love the colors. And I guess I need to continue that. But that's those whips. <laughs> and now, that makes me laugh. I have three more. <laughs> no. <laughs> Breath, water. <laughs> oh, wow. You need breath to swallow your water. Yes, you do. <laughs> There's another thing I did when we were here. I don't know if this was at the other house in Oregon or the one I left. The one I was kicked out of. No. Wow. <laughs> I made, oh, it was, the older sister was there. So we were at the other place. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. 
And so I made oh like yeah four layer cakes of half square triangles in all these different Civil War colors. You would make such a good manufacturer. You would I just know. I could be a factory. Yeah, you could be. <laughs> so I have all these that I have to figure out. Well, Are you, uh, what you're going to do with them? Oh, my <laughs> word. <laughs> but they're all done. I mean, they're all. Yeah, ready, ready to put together. And then I did Quilt As You Go projects. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. This one we did at the other house in Oregon, the one you're in now. Oh, oh my God. I, made all these I remember when you made those. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what's this one well you've been cleaning out yeah i don't it, you know i don't think i have enough of these i could probably make a table a runner table runner or something i thought i had one with because those aren't quite your colors oh, this one, no this one i got fancy with oh, this is um she's up here jara brandvig this is her fabric line okay and i got you can't see but i got fancy with Oh, look at that. You put, you I put, a, oh, yeah, cute. Are you going <laughs> to do that on all of them? I don't know. I, it looks like I started putting them together, and, but I ran out of lace. I was going to say, I remember the lace. Yeah. So <laughs> I have lace now. <laughs> and then, you're not going to believe this. No. And I have them in these little. Oh, yeah. yeah. That Cheryl, Cheryl and Patty, we Patty, we like taught me about. This is Ailey Abilene. She's a painterly collage pattern by Laura Heine, or Heen, however. Oh, and what are you doing? What? Stop. She's chewing. Stop it. What is she chewing? Ow, Wait, lady. She's chewing tags. She's, She's a doing... chewer. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. Did you start her? Okay. I will show you. And then, what's your name? I can't remember. Robin. Robin? Robin. She, not Robin that worked at the quilt shop. The other No, one. Robin um, that does Laura Heine. Um, yeah. Happy she, Valley Mercantile. Yeah. Ha yeah. Happy Valley Mercantile. I'll link her below, too. And she kitted me up, and I wanted it in black and white. Because you remember... Yeah. Color. Color. Yeah. Color. Yeah. Problem. <laughs> and so I think you were with me when I did this. We were. We took a class, didn't we? Yeah. So I think I have it drawn out. Drawn out. And then are the is the black part the um outline? Yeah. Well, I have some stuck on there. Right, that's what I mean. Those are the outline. The fabric yeah. outline, yeah. Yeah, that's great. Yeah, so I have that. <laughs> and then... <laughs> oh, I gotta start. I was on the move to start going through my stuff, and um, yeah, then the I... Yeah, page. Yeah, then I hurt myself. Yeah, then... Then I just laid in bed and cried. <laughs> okay. I do that, too. I moan. It's like, because the spasms are like... Oh, it's the worst part. Burn something. Yeah. I timed them. And Ed was so good. Uh, yeah. And then, I, you know, I have all my Civil War blocks. Oh, my gosh, sister. Those blocks are done. Kind of I'm sure they're all done. But then I got inspired when I found them because I thought, you know, this is Civil War fabric. So... There, that could be an applique. Oh, yeah. Who is, Who is that? Oh, sister, that's a smart idea. And then that could be on there. Oh, yeah. And we have to have pop hat. Yeah. So, and then one more. Put it together, and then you're going to um, put the put in black. Yeah. One of those. Oh, that will be so cool. Yeah, like the little silhouette ones I did, I think. Yeah, Anna for the Halloween. Yeah. Okay. And then. No, not another one. One more. Oh, my you, gosh. one more. And I think you got this for me. <laughs> I'm never showing all of mine. <laughs> I know. 
Well, if I die first, James will probably send him. James and Bobby will probably send them all to you. <laughs> this is well, American's Garden Quilt. In the oh beginning. yeah, oh oh yeah, I it got that for my for birthday, like when in my sixties. Yeah, sometime in my sixties. And then, yes, I have all these done too. I have, <laughs> I have one, two, three. I have eight more to do. Oh my word, sister. And yeah. that was a quilt for your bed because you because you liked it and you like color, yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, I like this because it's all the states colors, yeah. all the states flowers. There's some states. Remember, I remember this now. There's some states I didn't want to do. Remember, and you told me stop it. Yeah, stop it. Get over myself. We're all together. Yes. Uh, are you? Were those paper pieced or were they sewn? Those were sewn. Okay. There's also a paper pieced one too. I also have that because you remember you organized all my little yeah. What are those <laughs> called? EPPs. Yeah. Yeah. So I was going to do two of them. I, done. I made Cheryl save all of her scraps. She had a whole bucket of scrap for me. Come on. And, Come on. Okay. Sorry. Let's she do. Had shots today. Oh, so she shots today four. again. Yeah. Don't hurt your back. Lady, be a good girl. Ch Ch Lady, Ch look at Auntie. <laughs> Auntie. I Ch Hi. Hi. She reminds me of Auntie Evie's dog. What was that dog's name? I don't know, but I feel bad that she, I hurt her Let's arm. See. You hurt her arm? Well, she had shots. Oh, you didn't hurt, sorry. Her, hurt her arm. Let's do the giveaways from last time. I'm trying okay. to get, I, I'm sorry that I'm speedy, but I know pretty soon Cheryl's going to look really in pain and I'm going to feel bad and you're all going to think I'm the bad sister because I'm going on and no, on. No, nobody thinks that. I usually don't even do the talking. Cause yeah, usually, you're I did. So there were two patterns, the early bird. Oh yeah, that one was super cute. The winners of this are Verpy R two two four five three, yay Verpy, and Robin Morgan nine four two nine, yay Robin, that's fun. That was Bert, and they, and I'll put all this. You, you can email me. There'll be a link below where there's going to be that sponsored twenty percent off of the coach box, and all the, all of our information will be below. So you just have to email me so I can get your address. If you are out of the United States, you will probably get a PDF pattern. Yeah. Okay. The second one is Daisy Patch. And the keyword for this was Daisy. Yeah. Daisy. Cute. Daisy. Daisy. Um, two winners. One is Bibbidi Bo. Oh, I like that name. Bibbidi Boo. Bibbidi Boo. 3133. Yay. And Dave F sixty five ninety four. Yay, so Dave! Won the Daisy Patch. Then there, how you how you holding up there? Good. I just keep smiling. Okay. <laughs> Here's the peppermint. Here's the peppermint bark. Oh yeah, I like the, that one. The keyword was bark, and there were two give two of these. And Donna Boyd five one zero eight. Yay, Donna! And Quilt Ma. And you don't have a number behind you. You're just quit mom. So well, you guys, how did she get that? I don't know. <laughs> Grand, grandfathered in, grandmothered in something. <laughs> so again, I need your email address. Color me crayon. And there were two patterns and the give the, these were all provided to us by Fat Quarter Shop. This is one by yeah, Fleming 8036. And A Prater hey, zero, Audrey? zero. Either A Prater zero zero or, or A Prater O. Hey, I like A Prater O. <laughs> A Prater. A Prater O. <laughs> Two more. The poinsettia. The keyword is poinsettia. There were two giveaways for this. And the winners are Lynn Ellis, 2448. And Kim Mitchell, 7049. Yay, Lynn and Kim. Last but not least is <laughs> Chantilly. 
two of these, and the winners are Pat's 5023 and Carol Orion at 5130. Yay, Pat and Carol! Or Carol Lorian. Oh, think. Carol Lorian. Yes, Carol Lorian. <laughs> All right. And so if you guys could get a hold of me, I will email. I mean, yeah, well, I will either PDF or mail them to you. This week's giveaway. Look at me being efficient. I, I like when you're inefficient. No. You're being inefficient? Efficient. Being... Yes, being efficient. <laughs> so the first giveaway is the Milty. The Milty Quilty. The Mrs. So Milton Quilty Box. The Mrs. <laughs> Quilty Box with all the goodies in it. And if you would like this, say... Quilty. What? Quilty. 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 <laughs> say Quilty. And I have one of these. The I have two applique patterns to give away. One is from All Through the Night. This is um, folk art designs with a bit, bit of whimsy. And there's the... Oh, I love that one. Oh, can I win it? Yes. And the <laughs> other one, no. You can buy it <laughs> if it's still around. And it the is. other one is B Bunny Hill Designs. It's called Spring Fling. And Lincoln would like this one. It's oh, look how cute that is. So, I messed up. For the first one, what's the... This one is called Blossoms of Spring. What is the Blossom. key? Blossoms. So, so, if you would like this, put in your comments the word blossom somewhere. Like Cheryl's blossom, blossoming a migraine or something. But <laughs> this one is... Spring fling. Bunny. Bunny. Like Lincoln likes to bring mommy the bunnies. Yes. Lincoln then, does. Yes. And then the last giveaway is I made a quilt, a custom quilt, and that got mailed out yesterday. Yay. And when I was making this quilt, it was a whimsical flower garden. Mm -hmm. And it really, um, it was good for my brain and also scary because i've never just done something without you do one two three four even though i don't pay attention to one two three four at least it's there if i have to afterwards go back and say what did that pattern say yes exactly <laughs> so i i ordered some fabric and these were whimsical so they were big flowers i needed big big flowers yeah and so I ordered really fat, pretty. yeah i ordered a fat quarter of um flower fields by a fat quarter bundle by Maureen Cracknell from Art Gallery Fabrics. But those are all too tiny for my whimsical garden. So there's all the different. Wow, how nice. So if you'd like this, say. Garden. Garden. So it is, I don't know how many of them, however many fat quarters come in. <laughs> Let's count. <laughs> we can count. That's the part of math I can do. One, two, sale? three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, I guess. Fourteen. The tag normally says on it, like this one says 27 pieces. Oh. There's not, it just says the flower fills. Oh. One. Oh, I missed a bunch. One, two, <laughs> three, four, five. I think it's okay. They probably got the seven, idea. Eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Oh, and there's more in here. 16. So it's the whole, it's the whole kit and caboodle. <laughs> it's their, the whole fabric line. Yeah. That's what a bundle is. The fabric line for the flower field. Okay, so I yeah. think we told you what the keyword was, and if you'd like this, never been used, because, you know, there's color in here. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> and there's flowers. What else? Does probably not abide. <laughs> Crying flowers and color. 
<laughs> That's right. <laughs> and so, sister, what about Hall? Look at me. Um, I got the cream and sugar, and actually, I have a giveaway also. Um, I got the cream and sugar book to do the um, block of the month with the quilt roadies. Mm -hmm. And she's doing, oh, I forgot what the fabric line she's doing hers in. But yeah, I'm doing Civil War. I'm doing mine um right. Um it's American Beauty by Danny Mugstad. Mugstad. Ooh. Um so Ooh, pretty Cheryl. Isn't that pretty? Yes. Color so and flowers. Mine. Pardon me? Color and flowers. Color and flowers, the opposite <laughs> of calling. I want those but flowers. <laughs> They sent me an extra book. So oh, wow. I have a cream and sugar book to give away. So mm -hmm. if you want the cream and sugar book, just say cream sugar. and sugar. Oh, sorry. Cream <laughs> and sugar. Say cream and, cream sugar. and sugar. I interrupted inappropriately. And it um, it's a great pattern book. So and You'll then you can it. join in with Cheryl and Anna, and I think there's others that are also quilting along yeah. with you. Yeah, yeah, Anna's way ahead of me, though, thanks to my three weeks off. Yeah, our next quilt tube, I'm going to have to pick a winner for the, what was it, a pecking order quilt, remember? I said, yeah. yeah. So we have to pick, I have, so everybody get in your pictures. How do they get in their pictures? They, they can email it to you. Oh, yeah, email me your pictures. Or if you're in our Stitching with the Sisterly's Facebook post it. group, you can post it in there. Yeah. And so I talked about memberships. You can find memberships on the front of our page. It'll say memberships. So you could check those out if you're interested. Remember Mrs. Quilty. And I forgot to show you 20% off on the first box. I forgot to show you my haul. Uh-oh. I got Quilt as you go by Made Clever. Oh yeah. And this is by Jara Brandvig. I think this is her third or fourth book. And it's just got all kinds of I mean, I do like some color. It's <laughs> all kinds of cute, yeah. clever. Like the orange yeah. color one, I love that. You just like color that's in order. Yeah. I need that's what was really hard for me for whimsical because um <laughs> I had to put them all over. The yeah. sun, you know, the sun is supposed to be different colors of yellow, oranges. <laughs> I'm like, okay, the sun is is considered in school, you're thinking the sun is yellow. Oh, here's a yellow one. Oh, I like this one. So we just cut all of our rays that same color. Just all of them. <laughs> <laughs> the stalks that green well there's probably different colors of green on every stalk <laughs> that's true so i did go whimsical though to some degree along with so i did get out of my box i think yeah we'll have to see she hasn't seen it yet she may say give me my money back <laughs> <laughs> anyway so there's lots of cool projects and i think the first project that we're going to do is uh out of this book the first if for our membership Oh, good. And so anyway, there's just Project Galore. Oh, that's, yeah, that's great. She's up here. And, and she's had like the, um, I showed that book terribly. But she has the, but Cheryl's in pain, so I have to hurry. <laughs> she has a LaConnor um, collection. And it, it's just lots of, and this is all, you know, Washington State in her patterns that she's doing yeah just yeah and then anyway so and then there's even some mm, what is that that is, is it... what do you call that the vintage colors for magnolia mint inspired her to make some out of her vintage china collection oh and it's you know those things that you you go around and then you Nope. Crochet, tabby. They look like dishes. No, it's got it. So you use some of the orange peel look and oh, in the oh, 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 okay. So uh, it's an octagon with the orange peel. It's a little more advanced, but it's really fun and not, it's not advanced, you guys. I'm a liar face. It looks like it is, but it's really easy. 
That'd be another good one to do. Yeah, Taya taught me how easy those were. Yeah. Because I thought, oh. I used to think, remember when how you do corners? What do they call that? When you put on the corners and then it makes it round. I don't know. Okay, so you have a square and then you need to soften the square up and so you put a corner on it in. Not a ghost. I don't know. Something, something your corners. Oh, this is embarrassing. We're quilters. You, and then you fill it out and then it can make a star. It could do is somebody things. is somebody yelling somebody at say it please in the in the comments because Cheryl's on pain pills and it affects my brain affects my brain <laughs> because I was going so fast that I forgot maybe maybe she does something like that in here so I could just act like oh <laughs> you know you know where you where you watch the jiggerum <laughs> You're, you sew, you're so, on each corner you sew language these is too and half, on, on each corner you sew two and a half inch blocks and then you trim a quarter away and then you iron the block over. What is that called? Cheryl, who taught me how to quilt. I don't remember. Teacher, what's it called? <laughs> oh my heaven. Are we staying on here till I remember it? <laughs> yeah. Uh, cor corner block. I don't know. You put them on the corners and then you turn them. You trim them and turn them. I, I mean, it's not a cornerstone. It's cor a... no, I, I did it on all of my pecking order ones. Anyway, uh -huh. so Cheryl doesn't know much. So we'll just move on. <laughs> I can't think of what it's called. Wow. Well, somebody will remember for us. Yeah, Anna's <laughs> over there. <laughs> people are screaming at their yeah. screen <laughs> so anyway that's it for this video because sister oh wait a minute oh. I have um, one more thing there's um, a new quilt tuber um, mm -hmm. her name is Jennifer Lind and she is um, Madam Mademoiselle Rose on mm -hmm. YouTube um, and I'll send you a picture of this so you can link it down below, but she's starting her quilt tube. I'm so excited for her. <laughs> I just need a link to her channel. Yeah, that's what, I, that's what I'm yeah. gonna do. Yeah, we, a couple people have, Olivia Bede has, um, uh, Mary. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think Anna has always had a quilt channel, but she changed it to quilt tube. It's still her yeah. same channel. She just calls it quilt tube because we're trying yeah. to get it out in the universe or the algorithm. So other yeah. quilters and sewists, even if you make, even if you sew fabric covers, even if whatever you do, if it has to do with the sewing machine and yeah. work. Exactly. So we can get the algorithm. Yeah. Right. right. Yeah. There's nothing toxic over here. There's no um drama, no drama. drama allowed. We're at least not, not a drama watching. channel. Yeah, not a drama <laughs> channel. I get to watch those. I enjoy them. I'm watching the Chad Daybell trial and the Karen Reed. They're doing jury. So if anybody's into those trials, that would be <laughs> that would be I don't know what that would be. That would not be quilting, but I quilt <laughs> and listen to them. It's your legal side. Yes. <laughs> anyway, Cheryl, you got anything else? Jake's good. Ed's good. Nope. Yeah. Ladies got shot. Everybody's good. Yep. Same here. Good. Thank you. Thank you all for joining us. And I'm so sorry that it was, I don't know why I'm sorry, but I seem, it seemed really fast. That's because that's how Colleen does things. Have <laughs> we go down. Colleen there. does not allow Cheryl to chat. <laughs> Cheryl is the entertainment. Cheryl is the personality of this sister's nest. <laughs> oh, I don't know about that. Yes. <laughs> and I play well with Cheryl. <laughs> <laughs> Unless you're waiting in line with me and oh, calling behind us you're while I'm getting fabric. Then you hear. Then I hear My calling tapping your foot behind me, which makes me talk longer. <laughs> no, you find your fabric, you go up to the clerk to pay for it so we can then leave and go home and do something with the fabric. And she, <laughs> yep, yep, yep. She's like, oh, and the and the clerk who should be, you know, like pushing her along, 
it's just chatting up with me. <laughs> and then we go through Starbucks. And they go, oh, here, we're going to give this to you free. Because yeah. she's chatting it up with us. She turned to me and said, see, if you be nice to people. If you're not nice. I'm not, <laughs> not nice to people. Unless I'm in a grocery store in a in a." Wheelchair. Sister, I've seen you try to run people down with carts. No, they're in my way. It's not my fault. I don't <laughs> run them down. <laughs> anyway, I don't know. I, because you have learned to browse and enjoy shopping yeah. with mom. Yeah. I always like, I don't know what is in the store, but it makes me weak and yeah. fainty. Yeah, so, it does. I, it always has. My blood pressure would drop and have to go sit out in the hall. And she not was just happy was to do naughty. that. What? You were happy to do that. Oh, yeah, because nothing is worse than going with my mother and Cheryl into a pattern. To go to the pat when when they start heading to the patterns, you know it's time to act like I'm gonna be sick. So you can go well, sit out in the mall. I guess I could have shown shown you all the patterns that I'm gonna work on for making a jacket out of old quilts. Dopey, can you see it? I mean, I could grab it. Oh, oh no! I went pattern shopping. <laughs> oh, good lord! Look at what I inspired. <laughs> oh. Sorry, guys, we're still here. Cheryl's still on her pill. Do you oh. need to move a little, like stand up? And oh, I've been moving. Oh, these aren't the right ones. These are just dresses. <laughs> well, let me see the dresses. Are you just you do this to us all the time? Here's how Cheryl shows you. Look at the buttons. And then she's looking at it, but she doesn't show them to us. <laughs> There's that one. Ooh. What are you what are you making that for? Where are you going? That long red dress. And that one. Reminds me of the 60s. <laughs> and that one. Uh-huh. And this one. Yeah. But those aren't the jackets. The jackets must be here somewhere. I have three weeks of clothes? stuff. Are you I making these clothes or the de-stash? No, I'm hoping so. Yeah. I mean, isn't this one cute? Oh, I was looking at the one okay. that the model was in. No, because then your my arms would show. You know, I'd have to wear a well, sweater. I don't care over. if my arms show. I know. I'm too hot. Yeah. You're a hottie. <laughs> <laughs> well maybe you can do one in between that of the patterns of what you're gonna uh, you could even make those dresses out of old quilts if you so chose I that's so what your that's what your membership one's gonna be you are gonna make things out of old quilts that's what you said yeah 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 that's so, one of them yeah so i think there's and now i have a dog sitting right down here looking up at me like let's go all right, so that must mean Cheryl has to go. I know how to end. I know how to do it. Okay. <laughs> I know when you're done. Usually people know when I'm done, but love you, sister. Hope you feel better. Love you too. Quit playing pickleball. <laughs> Bye, Quilt. Bye, everybody. <laughs> Bye, Cheryl. <laughs>